What's up Deckers, welcome to another Steam Deck news video. In today's video we have a new Proton Experimental update. Discord got an update that improves video playback on the Steam Deck. Non-Steam Launcher got an update that improves the desktop performance. We have a Proton GE update. We have some awesome bundle deals. A lot of big games have gotten updates that improves the performance in the Steam Deck. Finally, the Magic Black plugin got an update that makes it better for the Steam Deck. So if that's something you guys were interested in, make sure you hit the like button, subscribe to the channel. Let's get right into this video so first in news for people who use magic black so if you don't know what this is this is a deck loader plugin that lets you pretty much dim your screen if you are concerned about burning if you have a steam deck or lead so with this update the dev state that he's been taking out feedback and he has completely reworked the plugin it says you can now disable the black background when pressing any button or when the steam deck wakes from sleep it's also possible to mute the sound and microphone when the black background is activated also for those of you guys who use steam deck as a controller there's now an option to enable or disable the touch screen and also there's a new way to reduce all the screen flickering so again if you guys use this plugin definitely make sure you check it out because it seems like a lot has been added with this update so next in news we have a new proton experimental update that fixes grandia arc raiders and more so let's break that down so now playable we have girls frontline modules distant worlds 2 and chronology and with this you can see that it fixed the black blocks and dialogue windows created by arc raiders and the finals and it fixed text input in secrets of grandia again check out this update if you guys were struggling with these games running on the steam deck so if you use discord on your steam deck it looks like the devs have been working to make this more usable on Linux devices and, and because of this it also benefits the Steam Deck and as you can see here there's an update that improves video performance on the Steam Deck so again I'll post this here you guys take a look at it let us know in the comments below if you guys are using Discord on your Steam Deck. Next in news we have a new Proton GE update this one titled Proton GE 10-26 and with this it fixes the Other Wars 2 brings FSR scaling and more so let's break that down as you can see here brought some fixes to space engineers it also brought some fixes to other worlds too and added proton fsr4 indicator to show fsr4 watermark and dlss scaling is now available so a lot with this update i'm still testing this one out i do think i'm going to make a dedicated video about this so if you guys were interested make sure you stick around for that so if you guys use non-steam launch it looks like they've been adding a lot of update to kind of prep for the steam machine as you can see here there's a new update to the desktop version so as you can see here it states that a very exciting update today for desktop users and also future steam machine users special desktop shortcuts as you can see here starting today will be given every non-steam shortcut very special ones the ability to run games outside of steam so again i'll be testing this one out it's pretty cool to see devs already prepping for the steam machine too let us know about this and let us know if you guys are excited about it so next in news if there were some bundles that you guys missed from humble bundle looks like they are bringing that back as you can see here the best of 2025 bundles are back for the holidays so this is a good way again if you guys miss some bundles that you guys can go back and get it a cool one that stands out to me right now is the wb bundle that they are currently running for 12 dollars you can get a lot of awesome games you can get games like gotham knight you can get games like Mortal Kombat 11 you can get games like mad max and more so again i will post this link in the description if you guys were interested definitely check it out also definitely check out instant gaming they have a really good deal for expedition 33 right now you can get this game for 30 bucks also if you want one of the hottest online games right now with our graders you can get this one with a good discount as well so again check out our link in the description if you guys were interested in getting any of these bundles so last in news i'm just going to rapid fire here because a lot of awesome games got an update that improves the performance on the steam deck we've covered two in the channel there's also two more that i'll let you guys know about here so the games are expedition 33 this got a massive update again we've covered it on the channel so you guys can look at that video to see the difference but as you guys know this one also got the verified status as well but with this update it does improve the performance the next is borderlands 4 now this does bring a steam deck preset and with this it does make the game somewhat playable it's still not the greatest experience but it is able to run better and if you're using stuff like loss of scaling you do get better performance with this next is path of exile 2 now this also got an update that does improve the performance on the steam deck as well 
We haven't spent a lot of time testing this one, but I have tried it and I am noticing a little improvement when it comes to performance. And last is Diablo 4. This one does seem to run the same, but this did get an update as well that should also improve the performance. But again, haven't tested this one out. Let us know in the comments below if you guys have. All right, fellas, that's all the news that we have for you guys. Let us know what are your thoughts in the comments below. Have you guys tested out any of these four games to see if it does improve the performance? Appreciate you guys. We'll catch you guys in the next one. Until next time, peace out.